Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go! A letter! It's news from my friend Kelly the Blue Whale. She says she has a problem and needs my help. Blue whales live in all the world's oceans. Right now, Kelly's off to the eastern coast of Canada and North America. Come on, let's go! Kelly? I'm here! Kelly? Kelly! I wonder where she could be. Hey, can you see her? Hello, Gatman. <laughs> Hiya, Kelly. But hey, why are you talking like that? I've got something stuck in my mouth. I can't get it out with my fins. Could you help me get it out, please? Yes, just don't move and give me a nice big smile. Uh, uh. Huh. There you go. It was just a fish. Oh, thank you so much, Jasmine. Say, your teeth are a little weird. They're not teeth. It's called baleen. I use it to filter out krill from the water. The krill? Yes, they're tiny little shrimp, my main source of food. We whales eat three tons of them a day. Three tons? How do you manage to eat so much? Just look. Krill travel in big groups. It's easy for me to catch them in my big mouth. And then my baleen stops the krill from getting back out when I spit out all the water I swallowed. Oh, wow. Your baleen is super useful. Yes! <laughs> Oh, you've got water spouting from your head. <laughs> That's my nose. We call it a blowhole, and it's what I breathe through. I've never seen a nose like it before. I'm not the only one. All marine mammals have a blowhole like mine. It allows us to breathe when we return to the surface. Hey, I can hear something in the distance, oh? a bit like someone singing. Can you hear it? Oh, those are my friends calling me. We whales communicate through song. I'm coming, girls. I have to go. They're waiting. Goodbye, Kelly. Have fun with your girlfriends. Well, goodbye, Jasmine. Uh. I got some news from Kelly. Huh. Oh, Kelly. Seems like she's going to need a ballon brush. Hi friends, my name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go! Awesome, a letter! It's news from my friend Uka the meerkat. He's inviting me to visit his burrow. Great, I can't wait. Meerkats live in the deserts of southwestern Africa. Uka lives in South Africa, right at the bottom. Come on, let's go. Here I am. Oh, it's so hot. Uka, Uka, ah, hello, but, Uka, Uka, but where are you? Playing hide and seek? Is that you, Jasmine? There you are. Well, yeah, it's me. Hello, Jasmine. Before coming out of my burrow, I wanted to make sure you weren't a nasty predator. We meerkats are very cautious. I can see. So how are you? Watch out, Jasmine. <laughs> Don't move an inch. There's a scorpion just uh, there. Uh, a scorpion? Yes, right there. Uh, uh, it's a bit like a spider, and it's very dangerous. But how did you know it was there, Uko? Um, we mere cats have highly developed fins, and we can detect dangers even under the fan. Uh, and you eat scorpions? We do, but don't you try it. It's just a meerkat thing. Mmm, and what else do you eat? Oh, insects, some small snakes, eggs, but also roots and plants. Oh my, scorpions and snakes? The desert's dangerous. Don't worry, come into my burrow. It's the safest place around. Follow me. Wow. It is so big on the inside. Yes, because it's my home. This is the entrance, but there are lots of rooms and tunnels. So it's a big house. Up top is where we keep watch. At the bottom's where we sleep. And there's also a pantry. Ah, uh, it's so great. <laughs> goodbye. Goodbye, Uga. OK, goodbye, guys. Who was that? Some meerkats in my family. A lot of us live here, and we're very organized. Oh, yeah? We each have a job. Some look after children, and some gather food. My job is to look out for danger so that everyone stays safe. That's great. Will I get to meet them? No, they're all out today, but I'll send you a photo. 
I can't wait to see. I'm going home now. Goodbye, Yuka. Goodbye, Jasmine, and stay safe, okay? I will. Oh, I got a letter. Ah, uh, news from Uka. My, oh my. <laughs> what a big family. Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go! Cool, a letter! It's news from my cousin, Chica the dog. It's been so long, let's pay her a visit. We dogs live all over the world, but Chica lives in Mexico. It's a big country in Central America. Come on, let's go. Here I am, Chica. Chica. I can't see Chica. Can you see her? Mm, surprise! Oh. <laughs> Hiya, Chica. How are I'm you? I'm so great. I'm so happy to see you. Here, I brought <gasps> a Frisbee so we could play together. Oh, great. I really love Frisbee. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so you also dig holes? <laughs> well, yeah, like all dogs. Then, thanks to our super sense of smell, we can easily find it again. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I also do to save food for later. Oh, Jasmine, tell me, what's your favorite food? Mmm, well, you know, like all dogs, I eat everything. But my favorite of all is meat. Oh, yeah, it's super tasty. All dogs love it. And what's more, we can gnaw on the bones. Oh, yeah, but do you know why we do that? It's good for our teeth and gives us fresh breath. <laughs> oh! Oh, listen, did you hear that? Oh! My mom's calling me. Oh, yeah, I do that, too. It's how dogs call each other. Hey, let's call back together. Oh! oh. <laughs> we sound like wolves. You're right. That's because all us dogs are descended from wolves. So that means our dad's 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 granddad was a wolf. That's why we have so much in common with wolves. <laughs> it's so cool to be a dog. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and what's more, we dogs can have jobs. There are police dogs, rescue dogs, and apparently even astronaut dogs. Oh. oh, my mom's calling. I have to go home. Okay, Chica, it was so fun playing with you today. Goodbye, Jasmine. Cool, a letter. <laughs> it's news from Chica. With a bone like that, she's gonna have super fresh breath. Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go! Cool! A letter! My friend Igor the Owl's written me, and he's inviting me for a surprise? Awesome! I wonder what it is. Quick, come on! You find owls all over the world, and Igor lives in Russia. It's the biggest country in the world. Come on, let's go! I'm here! Igor? Igor! Igor! I can't find Igor. Can you see him? Is that you, Jasmine? Ah, your head's backwards! Who? 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 Oh, no, Jasmine. We owls can turn our heads all the way around. That way I can even see what's going on behind my back. Wow, that's really useful. So flexible. <laughs> okay, so what's my surprise? Hoo, hoo, hoo. I think you'll like it. I just have to finish digesting. <laughs> oh, yuck, what's that? It's a pellet. We owls swallow our food without chewing, so I have to spit all the little bones and hairs. Ah, I see. And what do you eat? Some small animals, fish, and snakes when I can find any. So, ready for your surprise? Oh, yes! We are animals. Wow! <laughs> awesome! But I'm not too heavy for you? No, don't worry. I'm an eagle owl, one of the biggest owls in the world. But I do sometimes drop my prey. Mm. Oh, yeah? No, I'm just joking. It never happens. Hold on tight! Woohoo! That was great! I'd never flown like that before! Thank you, Igor! 
But say, your feet are quite strange. Those are talents. All owls have them. We use them to hunt. They are very powerful claws. Uh, Igor? Why are your eyes so big? I've just spotted what I'm having for dinner. I can see better with my big eyes, even at night. It's an owl thing. Oh, okay. I'll leave you then. Thanks again. It was really great. Goodbye, Igor. My pleasure, Jasmine. Goodbye. Oh, a letter. Ah, news from Igor. Oh, I see he found his dinner. Looks like a real feast. Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go! Cool, a letter. Oh, it's news from my friend Olga the Bat. Oh no, she's asked me to visit because she is a big problem. Quick, let's go help. Bats live all over the world, but Olga lives in Romania, a country in Eastern Europe. Come on, let's go. Here I am, Olga. Olga. I can't see Olga. Can you see her? Uh, here I am, Jasmine. Oh, there you are. Hello, Olga. What are you doing behind that tree? Hiding while I waited for you. I don't like being on the ground. Why not? Well, we bats, we usually live hanging in the trees or in the caves. It's easier to fly off that way. But I slid and I fell to the ground. I can't get back up. Can you help me? Of course, Olga. Don't you worry. I'll lift you up. <laughs> Is that good? Oh, yes, it's perfect. Thank you so much, Jasmine. <laughs> but why are you hanging upside down? Because that's how bats sleep. But why do you want to sleep now? It's daytime. We're nocturnal animals. That means that we live at night, but we sleep in the day. But how can you see in the dark when it's nighttime? I can't see in the dark, but I can get around at night using my ears by emitting ultrasound. What's that? Ultrasound. <laughs> I let out a cry and listen if it bounces back off an object or prey. But you won't be able to hear it because you need bat ears for that. Oh yeah, you've got funny ears. Sounds really useful, though. I can even hear the beating of a butterfly swing. Oh, yeah? Butterflies are so pretty. And tasty, too. You eat butterflies? Yes, and mosquitoes and flies, too. Bats really love them. Oh, sorry, Jasmine. I love to keep talking with you, but I need a good sleep before the night. No worries, Olga. Sleep well, okay? Goodbye. Good night, Jasmine. Thank you so much for helping me. Cool, a letter. It's news from Olga. It's true, she seems to manage really well in the dark. Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go. A letter. Hmm. Ah, it's news from my friend Ernest the pig. It's been so long. He's inviting me to come pick some mushrooms with him. Pigs live all over the world, but Ernest lives in a big forest in Europe. In Germany, to be specific. Come on, let's go. Ernest? Ernest! That's weird. I wonder where Ernest could be. Can you see him now? Hey there. Oh, there you are. What are you doing in the bushes? Hello, Jasmine. I'm collecting acorns. Acorns? Is that what you eat? Yes, I love them. We pigs eat loads of acorns, but we also eat chestnuts, roots, worms. Oh, yeah. So you eat a bit of everything? Oh, yes. But my absolute favorite are mushrooms. You want to help me pick some? Oh, yeah. That would be really fun. That's great. I think there are some over there. Wow, there's so many of them. They're funny looking. Watch out, Jasmine, because not all mushrooms are safe for eating. Ernest, can I eat this one? 
Yes, it's a penny bun. It's tasty. <laughs> You've got a funny nose. It's a snout. All pigs have one. Thanks to it, we can find the best mushrooms. It's highly developed. Oh, uh, yeah. And this mushroom here, what is it? Those are oyster mushrooms. And this? Watch out, Jasmine. That one's a toadstool. Don't touch it because they're very poisonous mushrooms. You know every type of mushroom? How do you manage to remember them all? We pigs have a very good memory. And that's why you should always pick mushrooms with someone who knows about them. Okay, come. We've seen all the mushrooms here. What a lovely day. It's so sunny out today. You have to make sure to protect your skin. Yuck, what are you doing? We pigs have very sensitive skin, so we roll in the mud to protect ourselves from the sun and from the insects. Oh, yeah. So mud can be useful then? Oh. Hmm. But how come you're not sinking into the mud? It's thanks to my trotters. That's how pigs avoid sinking in the mud. Anyway, we love rolling around in it. Wow. <laughs> it really is refreshing. Okay, well, I'm going home. I've had a lovely afternoon picking mushrooms with you. Goodbye, Ernest. Goodbye, Jasmine. See you soon. Oh, cool, a letter. Ouch, news from Ernest. Oh, my. He's going to have such perfect skin thanks to all that mud. Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go! Huh? Cool, a letter. Oh, it's news from my friend Jessie the Snail. She says she has something special to ask me. Hmm, I wonder what it could be. Let's go see. You'll find snails all over the world, but Jessie lives in the United Kingdom, in Europe, right here. Come on, let's go. Here I am, Jessie. Jessie? Jessie. I wonder where Jessie is. Can you see her? Here I am, Jasmine. Oh, wait, did you hear that? Here I am, Jasmine. Is that you, Jessie? Here I am, on the leaf. Oh, there you are. Hello, Jessie. Hello, Jasmine. So you said that you had something to ask me? Well, actually, we snails are very slow. Oh, yeah? Yes, because we're mollusks, animals with a soft body. But I'd love to know what it's like to move fast. Could you carry me as you walk around? Of course, my pleasure, Jessie. Climb on my oh. paw. <laughs> <laughs> it tickles. <laughs> Hey, it's sticky. <laughs> yes, sorry, that's my slime. I use it to slide along and move, like all snails. Oh, I see. So are you ready? Yes! We are wow, moving fast is great. I can go even faster if you like. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so tired. So did you like it? Yes, thank you, Jasmine. It was incredible. But tell me, what's that on your back? It's my shell. It's my home that I sleep in. Oh, yeah? How's that work? I can pull myself inside. Look. <whistles> All snails live like this. Wow, so useful. Hey, that's weird. All the leaves have holes. Ah, uh, <laughs> yes, it's because I nibble them. You eat leaves? Yes, we snails love them. And fruit, too. Oh, I see. It's time for me to go home now. Thanks again, Jasmine. It was great. Come back when you like. Goodbye, Jesse. Cool, a letter. It's news from Jesse. Well, seems like she's not short of food at least. Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go! Awesome! A letter! It's news from my friend Nara in the mall. She's inviting me to come play hide and seek. Great! I can't wait! You'll find moles all over the world, 
But Naran lives on the plains of Mongolia, a big country in Asia. Come on, let's go. Here I am. Naran? 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 I wonder where Naran is. Can you see her? Hello, Jasmine. Oh, hello, Naran. Uh, <laughs> I'm over here. You just need to turn around. Uh, oh. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, uh, sorry, Jasmine, uh, I can't see a thing, but I knew you were here. How come you can't see a thing? We bulls have little tiny eyes, and we don't use them because we have other things to help us navigate. Oh, yeah? How do you manage not to bump into everything? Well, uh, I have whiskers. Whiskers? Whiskers on the side of my head that are very sensitive and help me get around. Lots of animals have them. I also have excellent hearing and a great sense of smell. Oh, I see. That's really useful. So, ready to play hide and seek? <laughs> yes. Let's go. Can you help me find Naran? So, can you see her? You think she's there? Or there? We almost found her. Found her. Well done. You're really good at hide and seek. But say, your feet are kind of weird. They're made for digging. All moles have feet like this because we live underground. Oh, yeah? Yes, I live in underground tunnels. They each have a purpose. There's a tunnel to get around, a tunnel to sleep in, and one where I keep my food. Ooh, but tell me, what do you eat? Anything we find underground. Insects, larvae, slugs, and earthworms. We moles are hungry all the time. I have to eat all day to stay healthy. <laughs> Greedy guts. I'll leave you and let you eat then. It was fun playing with you, Naran. Goodbye. Goodbye, Jasmine. See you soon. Ooh, a letter. <laughs> it's news from Naran. Oh, well, <laughs> she's facing the wrong way again. Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go! It's a postcard. It's my friend Pablo the Crab. He's inviting me down to the beach with him. Off to Cuba, an island in the Caribbean, the largest of the Antilles. Let's go. Pablo? 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 But where is Pablo? Can you see him? He definitely told me to meet him right here. Surprise! Ah, there you are. I was looking for you. I was hiding while I waited for you. What are you doing on the beach? Are you relaxing? Ah, no. I just need that coconut up there. I'll go get it. Really? It's a bit high up for you, though. It's no problem. <gasps> I'm a coconut crab. We're really talented tree climbers. Ooh, <laughs> your claws are really good at cutting. Thanks, Jasmine. We coconut crabs have the strongest claws of any crab. They're also super tough. We use them to dig in the sand for defense or to eat. <laughs> you walk kind of funny. Yeah, like all crabs, I can only walk sideways. Like this? Yeah, you do it really well. But are you going to eat that whole coconut yourself? Oh, no. I've been invited to my cousins for dinner. I'm bringing dessert. Your cousins? Yeah, we're a big family. There are crabs on beaches all around the world. In Oceania, in America, in Russia, and everywhere else. Oh. We come in all kinds of shapes and colors. Ah, that's awesome. I'll send you a picture when I'm with them. OK, have fun with your cousins then. Thank you. See you soon, Jasmine. Bye, Pablo. Mm, 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 mm. Cool, a letter. Uh, it's a postcard from Pablo. Wow, so many of them. He should have taken more coconuts. Hello, my friends. My name's Jasmine. I love traveling around the world to meet all of my animal friends. Will you come with me? Let's go. from my friend Frank the Flamingo. 
He's inviting me to an afternoon tea. I can't wait. Flamingos live all over the world, but Frank lives in Camargue in south of France. Come on, let's go. Ah, I'm finally here. There's a pond. That's where flamingos live. Hello, Frank. I'm here. Frank? 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 But where's Frank? Can you see him? Ah! Ah, oh, hello, Jasmine. You're here? Sorry, I was just sleeping. Sleeping on just one leg? Yes, it's because the water's a bit huh? cold, so I keep one foot warm. Hmm, it's not easy at all. How do you manage not to fall over? My webbed feet help me keep my balance, so I can stay standing on one foot for several hours. Deep, 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 deep. Oh, hello there. Jasmine, let me introduce Tom, my son. Uh, but he doesn't look like you. He's not all pink like you are. That's normal. Baby flamingos are gray because they haven't eaten enough shrimp and algae yet. That's what turns us pink. Awesome. Is that what we're having for tea? Oh, Beep. yeah. I hope that you're hungry. Food's up. <laughs> mm, what a treat. Aren't you going to join us, Jasmine? Uh, I'll have a taste, but just a little bite. Hmm. It's, uh, interesting. Oh, yes. Do you want some more? Uh, no, no, no. That was lovely. I have to go now, but I'll come see you soon. Goodbye. Goodbye, Jasmine. Keep, keep. Oh, another letter. Thank you. Wow, that works well. Tom's turned all pink. Ah, so I must have eaten too much shrimp. I've turned all pink, too. I just hope it doesn't last too long. 